Hi, Marisha Pascal, 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 whatever, Marisha, yes. Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I'm here with my December TBR. So without further ado, let us get started. I don't know how well my reading is going to go this month because it is exam season starting on the 8th of December going to the 19th. So after the 19th, I will have a ton of time to read, but I might be working. So again, don't know how this is going to go. The first book I've actually already started and is called Made You Up and it is by Francesca Zapia, Zapaya, however you say this last name because I don't know. This book follows a girl named Alex who when she was seven years old, she let a bunch of lobsters out of a case at the grocery store and a boy who she called Blue Eyes actually helped her. Turns out that Blue Eyes is not real and it was actually a schizophrenic episode, her first ever, that she had. She's now a senior in high school and she's been living with schizophrenia ever since and she starts her senior year at a new school. That's when she sees Blue Eyes again at her new school and she is very confused because her whole life she's believed that he is not real. So when she sees him in the flesh she gets a little bit riled up and things go on from there. I'm only about a hundred pages in, but so far I'm really enjoying it and I'm very excited to finish it. Hopefully I finish it this month because I love mental health books and it's cute so far. So far it's pretty good. I think it's not one of those books that like romanticizes the illness, which I love. So, so far I'm enjoying it and I'll see what I think of the rest of it soon. The next book that I'm hoping to read is called Crank by Ellen Hopkins. If you've been on my channel for like a couple months now, you know that I love Ellen Hopkins now. This will be my fourth book that I've read by her. This one follows Christina, who is the perfect daughter. She's the perfect student, the perfect everything. And then she goes to visit her father, who has been absent from her life for as long as she can remember. And that's when Brie ends up taking her place. And she's the complete opposite of Christina. She is completely fearless. So through a boy, Brie meets a monster who is called Crank, and her life basically goes through a downward spiral, and it's that story of her life. And I'm very excited because I love Ellen Hopkins, so. And I'm pretty fast when I read Ellen Hopkins books because they just fly by, they're all in verse, so I will definitely finish this this month. The third book that I'm going to hopefully finish this month, because I've been saying that I'm going to finish it for the past three months now, but, you know, Bear with me. But it is Night Film by Marcia Passell, and I'm not going to say what this is about. If you really want to know, go look at Sarah Without an H's channel. I'll link it down below. She has a talk about how, like, you need to read this book because she loves it. And so I'll just link that down below, and you can check that one out because she does a great job in explaining why you need to read the book. I'm very excited about this book. I found it at the dollar store, and, like, it just seems so interesting, and I want to read it so bad. So I'm actually going to do it this month. Hold me to it, people. Hold me to it. And the final book in November that I'm hoping to read is the one that I'm most excited about. Because Macmillan reached out to me and they were like, hey, we have a copy of this book, do you want to read it? And I was like, oh my god, yes! Like, my little fangirl heart just, like, freaked out. But it is Heartless by Marissa Meyer. I know, like, <laughs> everybody's probably read this book by now, but your girl is way too excited because she has her own copy now, so. <laughs> yes. I'm not going to go into detail about what this is about because, honestly, like, everybody's read this book by now. But just know, I'm going to read this book and I'm very excited and thank you so much to Macmillan for sending me a copy. Like, ah, thank you. Alright guys, so that is my December TBR. Hopefully I can get to all these books. I don't know, maybe if my life works out the way I want it to. And hopefully exams go well. I don't know how that's going to go, but... I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!